Blue Election coverage now live at 5. The national conventions are over and done. Now it is time to get down to business as Democrats and Republicans focus their attention on the battleground states, like right here in Wisconsin. NBC 26's Cassandra Duval is live at 5 with that story. Bob, Vice Presidential Candidate Paul Ryan will be in Depeer this Wednesday. The following day, Vice President Joe Biden is stopping in Eau Claire, trying to get those Wisconsinites who are undecided for November's election to get their ticket to vote. Here in Wisconsin, we're not better off under President Obama. A new ad out by Governor Mitt Romney targeting our state. People are not better off now than they were four years ago, and we hope that uh, we can convince them that this is the right way to vote in, the, in November. Former Assembly Speaker Republican John Gard says things are not going in the right direction for Wisconsin. Higher debt, higher cost of living, higher unemployment is a failed vision. Create over 240,000 new jobs for Wisconsin. Romney's ad also promises new jobs, nearly a quarter of a million. There's been so much playing around with the job numbers uh, and the jobs reports that at this point it's, it's hard to give any credibility to any of it. Brown County Democrats aren't on board with YAT, but one thing Democrats and Republicans can agree on, how important Wisconsin will be in the election, with both Vice President Joe Biden and Congressman Paul Ryan making stops this week. Paul Ryan's impact is uh, more down around Milwaukee than it is up here. You can't discount any state, and certainly the Democrats aren't going to be w discounting Wisconsin. But the candidates are going to focus on northeastern Wisconsin because the people living here could really have a significant impact on deciding who's the next president of the United States. Both camps trying to win all of the state's 10 electoral votes come November. The two most recent Wisconsin polls done in mid-August show President Obama and Romney about even. Now, the president easily won Wisconsin just four years ago in the 2008 election. Cassandra Duval, NBC 26.